In this video, we will try to solve a question on finding the saving ratio from the given ICOR that is incremental capital output ratio population growth and the growth rate of an economy. The question is like this. Given incremental capital output ratio is equal to 5, population growth is 2%, growth rate economy want to achieve is 3.5%, then we have to find the level of the saving ratio for the economy, okay? So, how do we solve this very question? It is actually the Herod Dahmer uh, question and I got it from a friend and it was like this. He has not mentioned uh, the context of the question. Uh, I believe it is about the Herod Dahmer uh, economy, okay? So, what we are being given? We are being given ICOR, that is incremental capital output ratio is 5, okay? That means we need 5 units of capital to uh, produce 1 unit of capital. Okay, population growth rate is given as population growth rate is 2%. Okay, and uh, the growth rate economy want to achieve is 3.5%. And we have to find the value of S. Okay, we need to find the value of S. Now, what is uh, the relationship between growth rate and uh, saving ratio in an economy? This is given by Harold Dahmer. That is, growth rate. Uh, I will write here. Growth rate per capita is given by that is equal to investment investment ratio upon incremental capital output ratio. Okay. Since we have population as parameter and we subtract population, okay? So, this is the uh, growth equation uh, in the Harrod Domer model. And uh, one of the basic assumptions of uh, the Harrod Domer model is whatever is invested, or uh, sorry, whatever is, uh, whatever is saved is invested. That means S is equal to I in Harold Dahmer model. Okay, actually, I have made a, brief, a very uh, precise video on the Harold Dahmer model. You can check there how do we get these very terms. Okay, so in place of S, or oh, sorry, in place of investment, I can write S. So we have S in place of investment, I have written S upon ICOR minus population. Okay, so this will be our growth rate per capita and let us denote it by g okay now what is the growth rate that the economy want to achieve that is 3.5 percent so i will write in place of g i have 3.5 percent okay is equal to s upon icor that is incremental capital output ratio for the economy is 5 minus what is the population growth rate that is 2 percent okay now solving for S. So we have if we transpose this to our LHS, it will get added. So we have 3.5% plus 2% is equal to S upon 5. So this comes out to be a 5, 3% plus 3.5% plus 2% comes out to be 5.5%. That means I can write like this S upon 5 is equal to 5.5 percent okay or S that is saving ratio for the economy will be 5.5 percent if we transpose this it will get multiplied so we have 5 here or which is equal to 5 5 is are 25 we have point here 5 5 is are 25 26 27 that means the saving ratio for the economy to achieve a growth rate of 3.5% given the population growth of 2% and ICOR of 5 is 27.5. Okay, I hope I make myself clear in this video. Um, if you find uh, any error in this video, please let me know. And I am not sure whether I have done it correctly or not but i guess i have i have done uh, the calculation correctly so if there are any mistakes in this video just please inform me i will try to rectify them out okay 
and uh, the last request i made for you was that to please share and subscribe this uh, channel econ mathes that is the only motivation for me to keep going on otherwise i don't uh, at times i don't think uh, it is feasible to pay, make the free videos for you people okay so if you want more free videos on youtube then please share subscribe like comment or whatever you can do to magnify this channel okay thank you